I think United Way is awesome. <laughs> Kathleen and I are excited to be uh, part of this year's campaign. We have received such a warm welcome the past four and a half years while in Porter County in Northwest Indiana, and we felt that it's our turn to give back on a different level to see how we can continue to impact the lives of so many individuals here in Porter County. Kathleen started her volunteer work with the United Way and saw an immediate impact just in the volunteer aspect of what she was doing and saw such a great exposure United Way had for the entire county. The United Way touches nearly 70,000 lives a year with their United Way campaign funding involving roughly 38 partner agencies. One of the phenomenal pieces of United Way's structure is that the vast majority of the funding stays in Porter County so that we can be sure that the lives of Porter County residents are impacted directly with these dollars. The dollars that you contribute to this year's United Way campaign provide the stability and the building blocks for healthy living, education, and financial stability. We're pleased this year to announce that the Lilly Foundation has offered the opportunity for any United Way contributions that are new or increased from last year's giving session will be matched with a Lilly grant. Valparaiso University has got a phenomenal history of giving with the United Way that spreads over 50 years. This is a challenging time uh, for uh, many segments of our community, social services, uh, arts and culture, education. But through United Way, uh, you have the opportunity through one organization to help many other organizations and that one gift made to United Way uh, can be used to help many people in our community. Valparaiso University has been a partner with United Way for 54 years, that's five decades or half a century uh, that we've been a partner, a partner that United Way relies on and uh, it's a way uh, for our university community to do what it does best and that is to serve others. First, we've got this uh, terrific program that uh, was generated by the softball team uh, where our young women athletes got together and they thought about what they might be able to do in the community and so uh, they began to uh, create these and gather these bears that they would give to kids uh, and uh, those kids could have them uh, at moments in their life uh, when they needed, um, when they really needed a hug or some love or some attention. And now that's blossomed into something called Reading Buddies. Uh, we've uh, sponsored uh, the Valpo Day of Caring, uh, where uh, last year 500 students got together and they went out in the community and did a variety of things from uh, helping to clean and maintain agencies, paint, do a variety of things to other kinds of support in that, in that one day of caring. Uh, and finally, uh, connecting with our teens in the community, we do a Battle of the Bands uh, to show the power of youth. And that, that is a fundraiser, uh, where, which we do in the ARC, uh, where bands come together, they raise money, and then those young people take the money that they've raised and determine where they want it to, uh, to give it in the community. Uh, that's United Way, it's people giving to people in ways that transform the lives of people who live just down the street. That's why I give, and I hope you'll give to United Way.